So Daniel Cormier defended the belt in this division earlier this year versus number two for the undisputed title. Well, the reality is this qualification of the fight that he was absolutely dominant in. This has incredible physical skills. He's long and tall like John, and I cannot wait to see this, especially after what we just saw. I'm telling you, in UFC history tonight, they run it back, and the winner exits. I was extremely arrogant when I fought. I was in it just in the first time I... John Jones remains light heavyweight champion. Wow. Look at the cut over the eye of John Jones. I was personal life. Missing practices, being at practice all over. Unfortunately, we're seeing... Then it, it's what's worth... Oh, nice uppercuts. Oh! This has been the most heat down. Incredible. John Jones gets taken down. Oh, a diluted version of myself the first time. Oh! He's not physically prepared. That my heart's always in the right place. You know, a lot of people believe John, nothing else. Beating John is bigger than taking the life heavyweight belt more than ever. And I'm going to push the pace more than ever. Yeah, I'm right. Alexander Gustafson, give you guys this fight. You should have saw the first. Contender Alexander Gustafson trying to become the first Swede to pro career. Says he's had a lot of time to heal and slow things down. Outside of competition, but not a long time outside of training. And he has been physically, he has formulized the strategy. Tonight's prep point is brought to you by Modelo Brew for those with a fighting fight in round four and five. You can't let those rounds slip away. But first of all, two fights where I've gone to distance now, and I'm very confident in my cardio shot. 15th U.S. split decision setback, and of course the aforementioned fight with John Jones. Enjoys it more. Joe Rogan, this man is ubiquitous. He looks to regain his status as the undisputed UFC light heavyweight champion. What, what you see with John is unprecedented talent. We saw that he's a man who figures out a way to win. And he has got different tools that he uses than everybody. He keeps range with his kicks, and you get to the pocket different than anybody in the world. He can help you from the outside. Every kick you can think of from the outside to walk you into his power. He's very much in fight against Alexander Gustafson because he's got the opposite tools for one of the greatest fights of all time. He really made a weight cut, which candidly wasn't always the case. He isn't disciplined in just a lot more food. First fighter to weigh in 204 pounds. Johnny and he's the type of guy that rises. The most disciplined camp he's ever had with the highest stakes ever. Bones only seven have gone the distance. He has a new boxing coach, Aaron Sword, tonight. This tale to take for our main event is brought to you by Modell Inch. But John Jones will have the five and a half inch reach event. Ladies and gentlemen, Modelo, sanctioned by the California State Athletic Commission. Commissioner Christopher Lee and Judy Chiro Camillo. And when the action begins, our rep brood for those with a fighting spirit. P3, the event all month long on the same network as T-Mobile. Those in attendance and UFC fans watching live from the Sola Forum in Los Angeles. Top championship of the world. Introducing first, he stands. Six feet five inches tall, weighing in for two light heavyweight contender in the world. Ah. And now it's a record, 22 wins, one loss, one no contest. To go by way of Endicott, New York, presenting the heavyweight light contender in the world. Jo <clears throat> All right, Joe, business, let's go. The rematch.
will soon be the undisputed UFC light heavy. Oh, you better fight. You better fight. Head up, let's go. And Alexander Black, John Jones is in what? Watch the teeth kick to the knees. That's what Jones would use. I'm going to use on Glover Vichera to wreck his shoulder. Faint more in order to take away those knees, those teeth to the knees that Jones throws on. Hurry. From Mike Beltron for the low strike. Yeah, we'll, we'll take a look at it in between rounds if it's if it's an issue. And in combinations, to see if he can make that happen in this match. One. Jones sticks to the body there. Trying to get Alex to duck down into that knee. We've seen it twice now. Boxer in the U.S. But he can elbow you from the outside like he's throwing a punch. He gets you to think. Those are the little adjustments right now we're seeing from Jones so far. And I'd like to see Alex go to the body more. And then work up top from there. Needs a whizzer. Alex needs a whizzer. Nice. And Good defense from both gentlemen there. Circle towards Gustafson's right. A lot of re -essing. It's off the switch of Alex, so he doesn't want to switch stance. He's Jones the move. Let's take a look at it real quick. Yeah, right in there. It was on the inside by John Jones. Go down. Call me you're down. Listen. You gotta keep the pressure. I gotta get him down. Just relax a little bit. Flow, pop, pop. It'll be there. Authorized reproduction or distribution of this copyright work is illegal and punishable. Well, to me, they trust his uh, his natural abilities. They trust his instincts. And it never ever looked like he was exploding. He was just nice and easy. And that was with an early attack to the midsection of Gus. Gus needs a leg kick by Jones. And I agree with you. Gustafson's got to open up with his. Makes your hands non-existent by attacking your legs, so you can't move forward into the use your boxing because the kick range. He keeps you at kick range. Alex just got it on the break by John. John's taking advantage of these opportunities where Alex isn't. He that he's waiting on John a bit. Well, he can't get the rhythm because he. Alex is a boxer. He needs yeah. to be in boxing range. There was a right hand by Alex. That got less cheap kicks from Jones this round, so it's allowing him to get his feet underneath him a little better. Southpaw stance. Stop, turn. Hey, over there. Right there. Right there. Alex also looks very calm though. Okay. He's good. He's gonna go. Okay, let's go. You understand? Watch your fingers. Johnny. Mike Beltron Furman warning Alexander Gustafson just over three minutes. He's opening up and John Jones with a kick to the body. You see Alex, he starts hopping on his feet more. He starts piecing combinations together. He's in and out more. That's Gustafson who misses with an elbow counter. A lot of pressure by Gus and somebody's he's having a hard time reaching John here. Check. A lot of face, a lot of head movement. John Alexander. Just here, keeping the pressure. That's what he needs to do the fight right here the entire time. Strong kick by John. And you see anytime Alex switches to Southpaw, he gets... He caught Gustafson on the way in. 90 seconds to go in the round. Discrepancy in terms of the time spent advancing. Ooh. Oh, he heard him with that one. That's what he's doing. He he's him. switching up the kicks. He goes low. Oh, he got Alex. He's got to let his hands go more. I think Alex's left leg is hurt. Wow. Yeah. And that right hand landed heavy. For Alex. Dab out of the orthodox stance now. Steps in. Nice elbow on the break from John Jones. That last kick to the okay. body, the way he's tightened up. Before okay. Okay. Listen. Run it. Because you're not moving. Move it. Move it. Move it. He's pacing himself. Front kick to the body. And here, 
And a good right hand over the top by Gustafson. And here is that definitely a little bit of a limp to his step. Okay, they didn't have the spinning butt. His shin on the left side is significantly swollen from his right leg if they did that. We didn't see that. The big difference in this fight has really been the leg kicks. Good entry there by, by Jones. Leg clamped down. He's got Alex flat on his back. Alex needs to so tying up that arm and forcing Gustafson to be in that position. Come up top towards his head so he can get down, get that leg out of there. John's reaching back, maintains that position in half guards. Sliding that arm through for the crucifix. Drops down. It. I was going to throw his hook in. He's going to take side. it back. He's going to take Alex. Oh, big oh. shots. Big shots Gustafson by John Jones. Gustafson's in trouble here. Gustafson's John Jones stops Alexander Gustafson in light heavyweight champion. Masterfully done. Replay is brought to you by Nemiroff, bold character. Gustafson, they went 25 hard minutes last time. Tonight, John Jones. See here, John times a beautiful takedown. Gets it. And from the side mount, he goes to the crucifix position. Lands some huge elbows this far. That left hook in. And keep Alex bellied out to where he can just start unloading from Jones. And he gets a finish. Very nice fight from Johnish. Beautiful matchup. And Alexander Gustafson had some. Third at 205 pounds. He's a man who thins. You see the swelling on that left shin of Alexander Gustafson. And go by T-Mobile. Get unlimited high speed data all month long on the same network. On is called a stop to this contest. At two minutes, two seconds of. Undisputed USC. John. John Jones, welcome back. After all the pressure, all the chaos, and to have that UFC gold around your waist right now. Hey, you know what, said, man? This is great. This is a great feeling. Uh, uh, just so strong. My coaching staff, Tusa, Lawrence, Lawrence, Ali G, my, my team. Man, I, I just got to. Is there any difference? What was the pressure like? Uh, you know the different. Oh, Lee. I, I stayed in his punching range, and uh, and go back and watch the fight. Uh, he landed very few punches on my face tonight, especially when we get a rematch. Well, let's take a look at the final finish, John, in, in right here. Yeah, man, that's that's Gracie Baja Jiu Jitsu, and if he can get up quick, he does well. If you can hold him to wrestling, getting that right in time, and then after you get that, really fighting as a heavyweight, defending your light heavyweight title, becoming a two division. <laughs> what guy just gives up his belt because somebody else made it home? Daddy's home, DC. I'm here. Get your belt back. He'll be waiting right here. Johnny Bones with a big performance tonight. No champion bundle available for 24 bucks exclusively on X. I think that yeah, that's these, that these, has to take place. I mean, I really hope. And, and especially for DC. Because we know that DC for him to cement his legacy. If DC can win, what? Hmm. Well, I think he's talking about steroids. Yeah, but the fight still has to happen. That's the thing. I mean, all that can be said. And John Jones, beautiful fight tonight. And uh, you know, you got to have. How about that? Well, Jones has said. Why not heavyweight? I agree. I think I think heavyweight in, in general because DC's found a home there, and he's looked more impressive there than ever. Who knows? They do that and then do it at light heavyweight too. Right. What the hell? I don't know if DC wants to make that cut anymore. No, I don't think so. I don't think he needs to. He could stay ahead. Why not? Why not have it? Why not have it for the heavyweight title? I love everything about him. I love you guys. I love the fans. Division perhaps order has been restored. We'll see what is next. Heavyweight is a possibility. And I hope that.